Not only is the Public Health Ministry working to pass the law which affords expectant fathers paternal leave, but it also wants to give mothers more time at home to care for their babies. Listen to the argument put forth by Subject Minister Dr. George Norton. Because if we're promoting six months of breastfeeding and we're only giving three months, then, you know, sometimes it can be uncomfortable for a mother to really breastfeed for six months. The baby might, might go because it is recommended that you feed baby as, as you know, regularly done. Dr. Norton, during his ministry's end-of-year media conference, told reporters that 2016 has seen the issue of maternal and child mortality being put higher on the ministry's agenda. After maternal, then, of course, the, new, the, the, the infantile mortality. Babies are dying. It is a fact. Babies are dying, you know, much more than, than, than is supposed to happen. So we have to not only look at the mothers, but we have to look at the babies. The Public Health Minister went on to stress one area in which services can be improved to save the lives of babies. We find that a large uh, portion or a large amount of these babies die from sepsis. Okay? Regardless of, of the fact that they might be preterm, you know, or, or so on, sepsis is the cause. So we are working in that direction. It is no secret that overcrowding at the Georgetown Public Hospital Corporation is a sore issue, particularly when this occurs in the maternity ward, where two babies and two mothers are forced to sleep on one relatively small bed, which results in mothers getting no proper post-delivery rest, as their nights are spent maneuvering their babies and taking turns lying down. Norton is promising that this situation will soon cease, since efforts are being made to strengthen maternity wards at regional hospitals so that less patients are transferred to the main institution in Georgetown. He made reference to the fully capable Lenoir Hospital. They actually have a maternity section with wards, with a boarding room, with a neonatology unit that is not in use. And you've got good mattresses, good beds, everything, nurses station, and it's not in use. Well, we're going to put that in use as early as possible. Additionally, the minister reported that expansion works are rapidly moving apace on GPHC's maternity ward. Approximately $235.9 million has been budgeted and is currently being expended on this project.